and friends I'm gonna show you some faulty postures because of using cell phone in a wrong way can lead up to your neck pain as well as to your shoulder pain as well as the fingers and hand can pain because of it so it is when you actually go inside into the phone you shrug you protrude your shoulders ahead and are looking into it that's where the neck pain can arise so the posture when you are completely down inside in the cell phone and going into it will create a shoulder pain as well as a neck pain make sure your arms are supported your eyes are looking down in the phone when you are chatting over the phone this will help you in not getting headache neck pain or shoulder pain one more important thing is while working on to it don't keep it far and work across or don't keep it so close while working into it your arms at 90 degree or a bit low and then you can work third other mistake which most of the people make is while lying down when you are actually using your cell phone while lying down on the couch and then playing some games and working across it or seeing or then going into one side and then looking on to it. This will certainly create a lot of neck pain as well as the shoulder and arm pain and then the pain will start radiating at the back side. So if you avoid such faulty postures, you won't get neck pain or shoulder pain. And if you get one, then there are some exercises and stretches and there are some self-releasing techniques which you can also do to ease out this pain. Contact your nearby physio or some stretches I have posted on my channel which is on YouTube, Pranchisha Arora and you can check some neck, shoulder and arm stretches so that if you have got that pain, it can ease it that up. But make sure you don't do this again, the faulty posture, otherwise it will reoccur. Thank you.